What's up guys and welcome to another tutorial and today I'll be showing you how to make the AT bash cipher um, encryption function I'm not sure about the pronunciation of the AT bash but here we go this tutorial was requested by one of you guys so I decided to make it so first of all if you don't know what is AT bash cipher um, it's it's actually a method of uh, characters or alphabets encryption, and basically what it does is that if you enter an A, then you will get a Z. If you enter a B, you will get a Y. So basically, how we'll be doing this? We'll be using the ASCII code of the characters. So basically we will determine the ASCII code of the character that we want to convert. So assume that it is B. And we're going to minus this ASCII code from the ASCII code of the first um, letter in the alphabet whether it's a capital letter or uppercase letter or a lowercase letter. So basically, we're gonna minus 66 minus 65, so we're gonna get 1. And then we're gonna go to the last alphabet, which is Z, in this case, capital Z, and we're gonna minus the ASCII code of this letter from the difference that we've got from minusing both B and A which was 1 so 90 minus 1 is gonna be 89 which is Y and this is the concept that we'll be working on throughout this tutorial so let's get started okay here I have my form I have a text box for the input a text box for the output two labels and the button AT bash cipher so let's go to the code and what you're gonna wanna do is create a new function. So function at bash underscore cipher and this function will gonna give it a string um that, that is gonna convert. So by val input as string okay dem result as string and this result is gonna in this result variable we're gonna store um, our converted string and eventually we're gonna return this result okay so what you're gonna wanna do now is make a loop for each character in this string and convert it and then append this converted character um, to our result string so we're gonna use for each loop for each we're gonna name our character x as char in input so for each character what you're gonna wanna do is first of all check if this character is a lowercase character or an uppercase character so if char dot is lower this function takes the char as an argument and returns true if it's a lowercase so if this is the case then we're gonna do some code else if char dot is upper of x we're gonna do another code else what you're gonna wanna do is just append the input or I mean append this character to our output so result plus equal x okay so if this character is a 
lowercase character. So what you're gonna wanna do is actually we're gonna create an integer which is gonna represent the difference between this character and the first um character in or I mean the first the ASCII of the first character in the alphabet. So dem diff which represents the difference as integer and this integer is gonna be equal to ASC and this function returns the ASCII code of the character that you send to it. So we're gonna send to it X minus the ASCII code of the first character in the alphabet and given that this is a lowercase so we know that the first character in the alphabet is a lowercase a and then result will be result plus equal we're gonna append the char chr and basically chr returns the character of the ASCII code that you send to it so we're gonna send between these parentheses the um, ASCII code that we wanna get the character of it so the ASCII code is gonna be the ASCII code of the small letter Z minus the difference diff and here we go and we're gonna copy this code and paste it right here and the only difference is gonna be that this is gonna be an a capital A and this is gonna be a capital Z here we go so we should be now good with our function so we're gonna test it out so in this bun one click what you're gonna wanna do is write text box 2 which is the output text box dot text equals at bash underscore cipher of the input text which is in text box one dot text and here we go we should be now good to go let's test our program here we go so I'm gonna type basil tech at bash cipher here we go so I'm gonna copy this and I'm gonna paste it here again it should give us basil tech again here we go so thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more goodbye